This is Kit the Learning Companion sent to us from TTS that children and teachers can use in school and at home to support teaching and learning. And after just a few days with him, I can already see the massive impact it could have in my classroom. Well, the first thing I did was that I got my class to unbox him. Now the excitement around Kit was palpable. Some of the kids have taken him home to explore and play with him and look at the main features and then get back to me with ideas of how he could be used in the classroom. And the exciting thing is that I know by them wanting to get to know and play with Kit, I can then go into teaching mode and think how we could use Kit to develop teaching and learning in the classroom. Now, I could explain and demonstrate the key main features, but what I thought I would do is I'd get one of my top experts, a seven-year-old girl named Jasmine, to show you some of them. Hi, my name is Jasmine and I'm going to talk about some of the features of Kit. But first of all, I need to turn him on and wake him up. I'm just waking up. When you stroke him, he vibrates and um, sometimes his belly will change colour. When you go like this, He'll go like that and get very excited. This is how you take a picture. Just hold your finger on the camera button like this. To record audio, all you need to do is hold your finger on the circle button. It will count down from three and then it will record your voice. You can view your files on Kit or you can plug them into a computer with this wire. I love Kit, he does really cool things, but I'll let Mr. Hunt explain that to you. Now the reason why I asked Jasmine to demonstrate was because she was one of the first children to take Kit home. When she brought him back to school, he had lots of video and audio that she had recorded. She recorded herself reading to Kit, she created a short review, and what was really nice is she read some poems to Kit. Now our class poet at the moment is Paul Jenkins, and she read some of her favourite poems from the book Doodles From My Noodle, while she was sat in the kitchen. And the fact that she did this independently, at home, in her own time, just melted my heart. To doodle, oodles of doodles, and doodles of poodles, but not doodles of strudels, because of the spelling. Any more doodles? This one's called a bit Todd. Yes, she had pink hair. Yes, they would stop and stare. Yes, they'd all, they'd all pay the squid a quid. Yes, she was. A now I've been trained up by a bunch of seven and eight year olds. I've been using Kit in the classroom for a variety of things. I've used him as a class timer. I've got the children to evidence their learning by using the camera, by taking pictures, photographs, um, and video as well. But I've also used him for extension activities. Now what I do is I print off an activity before the kids get into school. I record um, the instructions of what I want them to do, usually via audio or via video. And then once they've finished their main activity, they can go to Kit, hit play, listen to the instructions and then have a go of the activity and what I've seen is more children are wanting to get to those extension activities because they get to listen to Kit and it's just a really great tool to have in the classroom. Here at Tottington Primary we are an inclusive school with a resource provision so what I wanted to do is let our Senko Miss Benz have a play with Kit and see how he can help support our learners with additional needs. Hello, my name's Michaela Benz, I'm the SEN coordinator here at Tottington Primary School and we've been really lucky to uh, try and run uh, this little guy here, Kit. I have to say it's been really amazing and really positive the impact that this little individual thing can have on um, children with um, complex needs within our environment. Uh, it's really helped with um, learning um, in terms of attention and concentration straight away, motivation is there straight away, they want to engage with this thing, they want to engage with their learning, they want to be able to video what they're learning. 
Um, it's really helped with memory because they can look back on the things that they've done and then they can talk about it, which also links into speech and language. Uh, and they hear themselves speaking on there or an adult modelling it and then they can play it back to themselves. And again, you know, they're, they're really learning that language and learning how to, how to, how to speak well. Um, brilliant for emotional support. I mean, I have to say, I think that's one of the key things that we've really noticed straight away. There was, a, there was an emotional attachment to uh, Kit, and I have to say, I have one myself. I like to give a little stroke, and uh, in terms of sensory stuff as well, when you stroke, you know, you get that sensory feedback, which again is absolutely wonderful. Um, home learning, if they can take it home. We've had children take them home for the evening, show their parents, show their parents what they've learned at school, show, so, talked about what they've learned at school. And again, that helps with um, home family connections and communication between us and the, and the families, which is absolutely wonderful. Um, I would say um, the recording element is, is brilliant, especially if it's children that find it difficult to record right, you know, in a written way or in, in the usual ways that you would expect children to do in mainstream school. But um, you can, you know, they can speak into it, you can record, they can tell uh, their learning, they can record their learning and tell you what they've done in it. So it's, it's absolutely brilliant for that and it takes that stress away from the children from having to get it on paper, which is absolutely brilliant. Um, independence, you know, um, if we give them a time for a task, some children can get really worried about it. They don't know when or how long a specific time is, so you can put the timer on and Kit really handily uh, tells them how long they've got. And again, that really builds motivation. It takes that anxiety and stress away from learning because they know exactly how long they've got for a task to do. So um, the confidence that comes from that is, is just wonderful. Um, the confidence generally that this little guy uh, brings to the children is, is, is really lovely to see. They just, their faces just lit up the moment they saw it. Um, and I can see this, you know, really, really helping with emotional well-being um, throughout the school, not just with our SEN children, but with uh, all the children generally. It also creates a, a little central focus and engages other children to come and speak to the SEN children that maybe normally wouldn't wouldn't want to approach or maybe feel a little bit intimidated but it takes that away because of the curiosity about this little guy so all in all I think it's an absolutely fabulous thing to have. Now as you can see the possibilities of having Kit in the classroom are endless and I think he's a great resource to have in school and if you're interested in having your very own Kit in the classroom just follow the link in the description. Nice little face there Kit. <laughs>